Hi, we are No Place for Hate, a group at Bethlehem that helps to provide a safe and inclusive environment for our community. We're here today to talk about Martin Luther King Jr., a social activist that played an important role in the civil rights movement in the mid-1950s. Martin Luther King Jr.'s goal was to end racial segregation and discrimination in America. His desire for equality made him an inspirational spokesman that provided hope for all African Americans. Sadly, many Americans weren't ready for the progression Martin Luther King Jr. was offering. He was met with a lot of resistance from white citizens all across the country. During the Brigham campaign of 1963, he and other activists boycotted and held marches to protest segregation, unfair hiring practices, and other injustices among the people of color. He was arrested for voicing his opinion during the Brigham campaign. As he was in jail, he wrote a letter addressing a group of white clergymen who criticized his work on civil rights in order to defend his work. Martin Luther King, along with several religious and civil rights groups, planned marches and protests to voice the issues around segregation and discrimination as a way to spread awareness to the issues. On August 28, 1963, the Great March on Washington was held to advocate for the civil rights of all African Americans. At the end of the march, Martin Luther King Jr. gave his iconic I Have a Dream speech that motivated and empowered America to do better. Martin Luther King Jr. was awarded the Nobel Peace Prize in 1964 for his accomplishments towards equality. In 1983, President Ronald Reagan signed a bill to honor MLK's work by creating a federal holiday for his achievements. The first Martin Luther King Jr. Day was celebrated in 1986 and continues to be celebrated today in recognition for Martin Luther King Jr. and the work that he did for the betterment of everyone in America. 